Hi guys, welcome back to Tree Channel. <laughs> How are you all doing, everybody? I hope you're doing fine. I hope you're happy. Yes, nice to see you back. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in, guys. Yes, how is your day been? Are you? Did you have a good day? Yes. Did you? Yes. Oh, I'm, I'm very happy for you guys that you did have a great day. <laughs> yes, guys. So, uh, yes. For those of you who knew, guys, hi. Nice to see you all. For those of you who knew. Uh, today's video is about the words of encouragement. Today's video is about the words of encouragement. Yes, guys. So if you like this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to Tree Channel. <laughs> Thank you, guys, for tuning in. Another new day again. Nice to see you all. Yes, guys. So today is a video encouragement. Guess what, guys? Which book? Which book we're gonna read? No, you don't know. <laughs> you can guess. Guess what? Which book you wanna read today? Yes. Good guess. <laughs> yes, guys. Today's topic is about the words of encouragement of the book of Nehemiah. Yes, guys. Are you getting your Bible ready? Yes. Okay, guys, today the words of encouragement is come from Nehemiah. Nehemiah, guys, chapter 8. Nehemiah chapter 8, verse 10. Nehemiah chapter 8, verse 10. Nehemiah said, Go and enjoy the choice of food and sweet drinks, and send some of those who have nothing prepared. This day is sacred to our Lord. Do not grieve, for the joy of the Lord is your strength. Okay, guys, I'm going to repeat again. Nehemiah chapter 8, verse 10. Nehemiah said, Go and enjoy the choice of food and sweet drinks, and send some of those who have nothing prepared. This day is sacred to our Lord. Do not grieve. For the joy of the Lord is your strength. Yes, guys. You know, guys, today I just want to share to you the words of encouragement from Nehemiah. The joy of the Lord is your strength. Yes, guys. It's a personal testimony, guys, today I want to share to you. I used to be, before I know Christ, before I know the Lord Jesus, guys, I used to be a very temperamental person. It's like I can really get angry, like, so easily, guys. I can just, you know, when I get angry, when something not going to my right, guys, I can really like smash table, smash chair, everything. I was so super temperamental. And I will have the feeling like sometimes like I will grieve and cry and cry and cry. Sorry. <laughs> I will just try and cry and cry and cry, guys. For like... For no reason, just just cry and be angry and upset and all these things, guys. But after I knew about this, uh, the book of encouragement, guys. I was one one day I was came to my room and I will pray and will pray and will pray and I will repeat these words, guys. I will repeat this word: the joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. For hours and hours, guys. After I really receive. And I was soaking in the presence of God in me, guys. And I was soaking in. And after I received that, yes, I was feeling, yes, the joy of the Lord in my strength. I was soaking in. I was like getting it. I like, really absorbed the words, guys. Like eat the words like one by one, one by one. That's happened like for the whole day in my prayer time, guys. Then after I received that, I was like, I would try. I would start like I can. I literally heard the voice of God like alive. It's like this word speaking to me. Like it's like the God speaking to me that for the joy of the Lord is your strength. As I was eating the words, I've absorbed the words, guy, and it's really speaking to me. And that night, guys, in my prayer time, I don't know how many hours I stay in my room to pray. And I was eat the words and eat the words and I can really feel like sudden peace and joy come into me, guys. And I was just 
laugh and laugh and smile and smile and smile. It's like people maybe think like, oh, three. Is that is that normal thing to do? It's like are you crazy or what? Are you just paranoid? No, it's not, guys. It's a personal spiritual experience that I went through. Then I really felt like the God really speak to me. That's why, guys, read your Bible like continuously, and you can really feel like the God speak to you. And before you pray, you must like ask Holy Spirit to guide you so that you you won't get the wrong interpretations of the word itself. Yes, guys. I remember, like at, uh, a month ago, I just lost my grandmother. This grandma is really dear to my heart, guys. I was really in pain that time. I was mourning and sobbing for a month. A month. I couldn't. I couldn't really feel the joy. The joy has like left, guys. And then I remember. The, when I reflect back, like God, like God, I can't be like this, like every day, right? It's gonna be frustrated because I'm not happy. Like I couldn't move on with the grief of my grandmother. I was I grieving for like I had grief for 40 days, guys. 40 days. It was a long grieving. I couldn't smile. I couldn't be joyful and anything. But after that 40 days, guys, I was really eating these words again, like like repeating, repeating, repeating the prayers, and then suddenly I felt the same joy, guys, that I had before like long time ago in my prayer room and then i can really feel like the god spoke to me and then i can really be smiling again be joyful again and then move on guys it was it was really a journey you know spiritual life is like a journey between you and god and today video encouragement guys is for those of you who mourn who grieve about someone that you have lost i can understand guys i can really relate to that awful like the pain guys just the is the heart right it's the hearts and then that is the the pain of our heart especially the one that we love it's really the, the connection of our heart guys literally is like broken like literally broken into pieces and the only brokenness of our heart that can fix guys is jesus don't you agree with me guys please put your hands up if you agree with me that jesus will heal your broken heart Yes, guys, I have tested that for for my grandmother's situation when I, you know, when all the family was in that grief, guys, we really felt like so lost, you know, because she was such a, a very dear to our family, guys. So we just grieve and grieve for the 40 days. It was really tough 40 days, guys, that we that we've been through. And thank God that that season has passed. But I can really tell you the season now that what I'm feeling now, guys, is a happiness. Yay! <laughs> because I found amazing people like you guys. Yay! <laughs> I thank you so much, guys, for each and every one of you. You have been part of the family, of spiritual family that makes me like to pull through, to go through. And I miss you so much. Every time, guys, when I posted the video, the last video, I was like, oh, I always miss you. I always come back and then pray again and read my Bible again and I was all continue to pray like God what do you want me to speak to my brother and sister who watching the video and I keep meditating the word of God guys and the more I'm meditating the word of God the more I miss you all <laughs> I miss you all guys and it's true it's an amazing journey guys but if I want to say to you like this journey has been great has been great if i want to say this two days or these three days guys it's it's the joy <laughs> it's like it's amazing the joy that i can feel in god i'm really thankful guys because i have found family like each and every one of you it's been amazing yeah it's great um guys so i hope this video encouragement guys this one i want to share today and i hope that you can learn something anything that is good anything that's positive please take it with you guys but anything that negative please whoo, <laughs> we will let it go <laughs> yes guys so today is about the video encouragement about the joy of the lord is my strength the lot of the joy of the lord is our strength yes guys I hope you'll be encouraged for anything that you want to do for the rest of the day. I pray that, guys, that you'll be blessed. 
um, I should have charged my phone battery, guys, because when I record this video, guys, I really should charge my phone battery. But the battery is running low now, guys. So it's time to say to see you again in the next video. But before I want to close this video, I want to pray for each and every one of you. Let's pray. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Dear Heavenly Father, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come. That your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today, Lord, our daily bread. Forgive our debts, Lord, for we have forgiven our debtors. Lead us not in temptation, O oh God, but deliver us from the evil one, from your kingdom, power, and glory, and forever. In Jesus' name we pray. I just want to commit, O oh God, for each and my brother and sister watching this video. Today, O oh God, we have learned your words, O oh Lord, in Nehemiah chapter 8 verse 10 that the joy of the lord is our strength we just want to pray that god for each my brother and sister who go through a mourning time who go through a grief a pain the season of their life i just pray that god that you may your holy spirit will remind them again that the joy of the lord is their strength i pray oh jesus for all my brother and sister for their life for their family oh god you bless them with the life of abundance i just want to pray jesus i want to want to bless each and every one of them who watching this video god may they have financial breakthrough career breakthrough the life of abundant life into their into their life or oh Jesus, into their family lives i just want to pray that god for all my brother and sister that they continue to pull through that they can continue to hold on to you oh god i pray holy spirit please you speak to them whatever the things that they want to do for the rest of the day i just want to commit each and every one of them to the palm of your hands and i pray that god that you continue to strengthen them knowing that you be with them oh god now tomorrow and forever days to come i just want to pray that god for each of my brother and sister that you continue to protect them for any harm i want to pray that god jesus that the plan that you have uh, continue that the plan that you have in their life oh lord jesus that you continue to fulfill it god the best of the best that you can give to each and every one of them thank you jesus i just want to commit each and every one of them in their life into the palm of your hands in jesus name i pray hallelujah amen Yes, brother and sister, this is it today. Video encouragement is about the joy of the Lord is our strength. Okay, brother and sister, if you like this video, please remember like, comment, share, and subscribe to Tree Channel. Wow, I've just seen a very beautiful body behind of us. Did you see that? Oh, there's another one too. Okay. Anyway, guys, have a great day, everybody. And for Jose, hi, Jose. I heard you want to start a YouTube channel. I wish you all the best. And we're going to continue this journey together. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Have a great day and have a good weekend. Thank you. Bye.